and find out what is going on in our classrooms. I was in Albany, Long Island. We did Long Binghamton yesterday, and here I am in Western New York just to continue my quest for the answers on how we can help our young people overcome the extreme challenges that they're facing. We have a mental health crisis in society, and it is on steroids for young people, in, particularly in middle school and high schools. I started this journey over two years ago to identify why we are still seeing negative impacts of the pandemic on our teenagers, why there's so many statistics showing that young people are contemplating suicide, one out of three teenage girls thinking those very dark thoughts, why social anxiety is off the charts, why there's uh, just such as frustration that young people have. And you take it back to social media and how we dealt with that in our legislature. I'm very proud of our efforts to rein in the addictive algorithms. But why these young people are constantly bombarded with this throughout the day is because their cell phone is attached to their hand. They cannot seem to put it down. And they're not guilty because adults suffer from the same, except young people should be in a classroom learning, being educated. That is the purpose of them showing up at school every single day. And what I heard from teachers and educators and school superintendents, this has become the challenge of our time. Teachers know what they need to do, but it has been so frustrating for them to try and overcome the powerful hold that a cell phone has on a young person. They're afraid of missing out. They're being bullied simultaneously. People are not liking their posts and it's taking them to a dark place. So while they're supposed to be learning, science and math and social studies, this is what's going on simultaneously. It's an impossible situation for them to learn. I'm gonna continue these conversations, but uh, today was particularly impactful because this is my hometown and I wanna help solve this, not just here, but throughout the state of New York.